What's up, people? Joe Winko here, your favorite Hawaiian guy. Welcome back to my next episode of the United States of Joe Winko. It's been a really long time since I've done an episode, but now I'm finally back at it. I'm still building up the United States of Joe Winko. I got quite a bit done, but I'm not uh, quite ready yet. I mean, I'm not quite done with it yet. So I'm going to be making my next city right here. And the person who got last episode's trivia question correctly was uh, BK Films Production. Well, Brandon, a.k.a. B uh, BK Films Production. So congratulations to him. He's going to be the mayor of my next city, which is going to be right here. And this city is going to be Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. So let's get this party started. All right, so this is going to be a little bit difficult to build on because the the landscape and everything. I have like a unif. I want to try like building the rest of my cities in like a uniform style, like roads surrounding all the major landmarks, because that's what attracts the Sims to them. But it's like very mountainous here. That's what that's what makes it fun. The challenge of building it. I think there's like a highway that goes through here. Oh, it's underwater? What the hell? Alright, this is going to be more difficult than I thought. Alright, now I know that that's... Alright, that's as many trees as I'm adding for right now. Okay, hopefully this works out. Harrisburg... Pennsylvania... The mayor's name... Brandon, a.k.a. BK Films Productions, whoops. All right, so congratulations to Brandon, and something's wrong here. What the hell is this? All right. I know that there's supposed to be a highway coming from somewhere around here. I didn't know that there was a river on this side. That's what sucks. Okay, because Interstate 81 was supposed to go through here. So I think... Nah, darn it. Might have to go back and edit my other city. So save and exit to region. If the game crashes, I'm just going to have to restart it. Because it always crashes whenever I exit to another city. Okay, it didn't crash. So let me load up this small town that I built off the record. Stony Point.
All right, so got to fix Interstate 81 so it actually connects. All right, like that. Okay. You can modify the terrain, even... So that road has to be connected. Alright, there. Got it. Now let me just save. And now back to the neighborhood that, I mean back to the city that like I was supposed to be playing as. Hopefully it doesn't crash. Okay, it didn't crash. Okay, Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Oh, it worked. Awesome. All right, the road's a little fucked up, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, because it's a, like a mountainous road. It's the most difficult place to build a highway from. Okay, so don't want to bore you guys of talking about how with talking about how complicated it is building roads for this game. So besides besides that, did anyone hear about the shootings that happened in Florida? at the high school. I thought that was really fucked up. Not sure if I want to do an episode of Joe Winko talk about that because that stuff is a little bit too sad, really. And I'm not really sure what to say about it. Like, there is one 16-year-old girl. I don't think she was 16, but she was texting her mother and telling her mother that if she doesn't make it, she loves her mother. I think that's kind of messed up for, for a high school kid to have to say that to their parents. It's sad. Alright, so gonna have to tear down these highways. Wow, I seriously cannot build. All right. Wait, I know how to how I could do this. Alright, maybe that'll help. And now... 
still pretty far away. Yeah, this is like the most difficult terrain I've ever built on. Okay, so I kind of got the highways connected. Um, or maybe I don't. Darn it. So I have to figure that out. more difficult than I thought it would be. Okay, finally, got them connected. And I better save my game. After all that trouble, I do not want this to crash on me. But they have no way of getting on that highway because it's like all up in the mountains and all mixed up and everything. Okay, there might be something I can do. Oh, I could add a ramp. One there. And one there. So... Yeah, but what else should... And I can't... I can't fit another one. It's just those two ramps. Alright, so this definitely isn't going to be a big town at all. Just going to have, like... So I don't want it to just be connected by interstates, I want it to be connected by roads, too. And there should be... Oh, that works. And more. Oh, there's another thing I forgot to add. Just remembered that. The money trees. Yeah, because this like in ter terrain is so difficult to build on.
Yeah, and I have one random on ramp there. Uh, this does not look good. Oh, wait. I can connect to that. I just don't want a bunch of roads that lead to nowhere. That's the difficult thing about this. So, gotta find a way to get the roads from there down to there. Okay, got those connected. Had to build a whole bunch of tunnels, but it doesn't matter. Um, so... Alright, around here is where it starts, where the terrain starts getting easier to build on. There's an avenue coming from here. And need to build Interstate 90 going this way. for the highway okay so got that connected are there any other roads there's one there and an avenue there okay so let me get those built up Okay, so now what? Better save my game. Almost got all the roads taken care of. That road is complete. Oh wait, nope. I don't have them all taken care of. Would have been better if I added that. Oh, that takes care of it. Okay. So now what? Let me just save real quick.
Um, so everything looks done just about now in terms of the roads. So now it's time to replace these with roundabouts. Is there any other... Okay. So... <laughs> it's hard, I'm trying to think of stuff to say, but so busy with this game. Okay, now just edit the taxes again. So, getting back to what I was talking about in my Valentine's Day livestream for The Sims 2, it's really messed up what happened to that one woman in Texas. What happened was, she, uh, she couldn't, she didn't get, she was diagnosed with the flu, and her medication was way too expensive, so she didn't get it at all, and she ended up dying the next day. They tried charging her, like, over $100 for flu medication that she needed. It just shows you that the USA's healthcare system is really fucked up. And very flawed, too. Yeah, but it's sad. I felt sorry for her. Alright, well, I added the Pennsylvania state flag. There's one building that I made. Can you find it in here? If I can find it. There's so many buildings I imported into this game. It's a capital building for Pittsburgh, for Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Harrisburg... I don't even remember exactly what it looked like, but I'll know it when I... I should know it when I see it. Okay, that's not it. Here it is. Yeah, it's a large... Ooh, damn, that is a large lot. Okay, I got it. And for the flags. Oh, the Interstate 90 sign should add that too. And. Pennsylvania flag. I'll put those right here. And is there more that I There's more that I need to add? Interstate 81 signs. Here they are. Okay, those are all the highway signs I'm going to be adding. Okay, so might as well save again since this game is notorious for crashing on me. So let me add the necessities, the fire station, the bus stop, the subway station,
and the wind turbine. And the water pump. Is there more? Police stations. Medical centers. Local branch library. High school. An elementary school. And college. and a soccer field. Oh yeah, and of course, can't forget to include this. Medical clinic. Um, so I guess that's everything I need. Except for the landfill zones, as much as I hate adding those. Let me save it real quick. I'll have the landfill zones over by here. And high density residential. And some wind turbines. So yeah, sorry I'm not saying so much during this playthrough. Just got absorbed in my city building. This is not how I wanted to build this city, but the terrain and the landscape is so di difficult to build on. Just hoping that Interstate 81 it actually works as a connection. There's not much room to build stuff here, really.
but it doesn't have to be that big of a city. I'm not sure how big the real Harrisburg is, but they'll be able to fit enough. And bus stops. Okay, there is subway connection from this side. Not sure if I can build it through here. Yeah, I think everything south of here is Pittsburgh, Penn I mean, uh, Philadelphia. Okay, so it's starting to build up nice. Population, 5,000 Sims. Almost at 6,000. Did they unlock the large elementary school yet? Yep, they did. And just gonna check all the city audiences. Okay. <laughs> Harris Harrisburg. That's where that new story of the guy like breaking into people's houses happened at. The guy was weird. Did an episode of Joe Winko talk about him a while ago. He was breaking into guys' houses and sucking them off. It's, it's creepy. <laughs> but I'm going to try to keep it PG. going to try not to talk about too much sexual stuff in my gaming videos. Pretty sure you guys hear enough of that already. But that is just what I thought of when I was going to be making the city. No. And I'm kind of out of it right now. I'm like basically awake only because of Red Bulls. My sleeping schedule has been whack lately. It's because my blood sugar was off one night and it like goofed up my whole sleeping schedule. It sucks. I hate having diabetes. But I got some Red Bulls. Hopefully that will help me stay awake. Or maybe. I don't know. Shouldn't take that too long to build up. Now, let me see if any of the Sims actually use this interstate at all. Oh, no Sims use it. What about here?
Okay, they kind of do. Definitely need more commercial lots. Well, to zone more commercial areas. I don't know why I keep calling them lots. That's weird. Even though that's technically what they are, I keep getting mixed up with the Sims and SimCity 4 and Sims 2. I don't really put much artistic detail in these cities now that I think of it. All right, we have a population of 14,000 Sims. Oh, now 16,000 Sims. And I'm pretty sure I, I unlocked the large high school by now. Yep, I did. So... Oh, there's another thing I should have unlocked. The mayor's house. I'll throw that right here. The city definitely didn't turn out the way I wanted it to. There's no one using Interstate 81 at all. Yeah, and I even had to edit the landscape, too. Probably shouldn't have had it connected that way. It's probably where I goofed up. It's population 21,000. So... As a matter of fact, I'm just going to pause and I'm going to save and end this part of the playthrough right here. So yeah, thanks so much to Brandon, aka BK Films Production, for answering last episode's trivia question correctly and for becoming the mayor of Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. It's not much of a big city right now, but I might build up on it later. That's what I do with all my cities, really. So, yeah, that's basically it. Don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. And don't forget to answer this episode's trivia question correctly so you can become the mayor of my next city in the United States of Joe Wanko. So that's it. Peace out, people. This episode's trivia question. Who was the fourth victim of Ghostface in Joe Winko's 2013 Sims 2 slasher film, Knifed 3 Hollywood Terror? Answer this question in the comments. The first person to comment the correct answer will be crowned the mayor in my next city of the United States of Joe Winko. Please also mention the name you want to be listed as. Remember, you must use the same name at all times. That is it.
Peace out, people.